I'm Leah Ella. You're watching The Stylist Diary on Stilo TV. I'm here with Carla. She's our model for tonight. We're going to be doing a head to toe makeover. And tell us a little bit about yourself, Carla. Well, I'm a manager at Abercrombie & Fitch and my usual style is very casual. I pretty much look like this every day, natural, no makeup, and just very classic, um, casual. So she's a natural beauty, as you can tell. And let's talk about your hair for a second. How long have you been growing your hair? Or have you ever cut it? I have cut my hair, um, but um, since I've cut it, it was about shoulder length. It took about seven years to get this long. Wow. Well, it looks great, and um, you'll just have to wait and see what we do with it. Where do you guys usually hang out? Like, just, you know, like during the week, where do you usually hang out? Happy hour usually. Um, after work, I just pretty much go like this and go to happy hour with my friends. Like sports bars? Do you like sports bars? I do. I do. Do you like athletes? Okay, I'm sorry. This is not a dating <laughs> show, I promise. Okay, um, well, that's good. So the first the first look that we're gonna do is a day to night look. Um, she usually goes to happy hour right after work. <clears throat> so um, you usually go in your work clothes, Pretty right? Pretty much, yeah, like this. Okay, so the first look is gonna be a day to night casual look. She can go straight from work to the sports bar. We're back with Carla and our hairstylist Tanika and our makeup artist Frankio. This is um, Carla's day to night casual look. So we remember what her uniform was. We spiced it up a little bit. Um, she's ready for happy hour now. Gave her some accessories. These colors complement her skin. Um, the makeup is earth tones, just a little bit of like glitter, I'll let Frankie talk about the makeup. <laughs> and um, she's showing a little midriff, which is fine because she has the body for it. And um, yeah, basically I kept the purse and the shoes nude and she's ready for happy hour. What do you think? How do you like your look? I know you haven't seen it yet, but I'm gonna show you in just a minute. Well, so far, I love it. I mean, I can't see myself, but this is something I would definitely wear for happy hour after work. Looks a lot better than what I was wearing. <laughs> and um, it's really easy to do as well. You know, we just added accessories and I just tied her shirt. And we lost that belt. If you, I would make a suggestion. I like this color better than the really dark brown belt that you had. So you might want to just switch it up. Yeah. Okay. okay. You're the stylist. <laughs> So now we're going to talk to Tanika a little bit about Carla's hair. Um, tell us about the tools that you used and what were you going for here. Okay, so for Carla's hair, Leah, what I did was I used a curling rod. Um, not a curling iron, a curling rod. There's a big difference. There's not a clasp that closed. And it's actually a pretty quick process. Um, we kind of just wrap the hair around the rod, and I was telling her it's literally like five seconds, and then we let it go. So that allows you to get more of like a beach wave versus a tight ringlet type of look. 
And what we also did was incorporated the braid. I was telling Carla how to do this braid at home herself. That way, it's a daytime look because it takes the hair out of your face, but you still feel pretty because the rest of your hair is out, so you're not really dealing with a big ball of hair on the top of the head. And um, that's about it. And then we can easily take this daytime look and flip it into a nighttime look very easily. I love what you did to it. And 70s, you know, is on trend right now. So it's kind of like, you know, wild child. It's very sexy, the beach curls. Um, I don't know about your job. Like, will they allow you to look sexy like this? <laughs> Definitely not. They prefer us to be all natural, no makeup. But this is a great transition to happy hour. You can do your hair like this though, right? Yes, I can do my hair like this, definitely. Okay, awesome, because I'm gonna come visit you at work to make sure okay. that you... <laughs> <laughs> make sure I follow up. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and now we're gonna talk to Frankia, the makeup artist, about the look that we chose for Carla. On today's look, I chose to do a soft, beachy look. Um, I wanted to incorporate the hair and the makeup together. I wanted to merge those two worlds together. Um, what I did was add a little bronze and a little peachy to her eyelids, a little bit of liner. I used a pencil versus a liquid liner or a cream liner. The pencil goes on very lightly to give you a little pop and not so much dramatic. And so I, that's what I did with that. I gave her a little bronzy look on the cheeks and a peach lip gloss versus a lipstick because she is going for a more natural look. So I just gave her a little lip gloss with a little bit of color. And that was her whole look. I think you did an amazing job. I love the earth tones. You know, it brings out her complexion. It works well with it. A little bit of um, glimmer on her eyes, like kind of opens it too. And her lips were already like pink. So the lip gloss is perfect. So now you have to like carry that in your purse so that yeah. after work, yeah. you know, you can just put, put a little liner on. Yeah. Definitely. Okay, good. I love this look. This is quick and easy. It didn't take long. So I can see myself doing this, you know, every Friday. <laughs> okay, well, let's show you how you look. Okay. I'm going to get the mirror. I'm excited. <laughs> Oh my god, it's so cute. I love it. It's very sexy, very classic. I mean, I would never thought of this myself. I love the hair, the makeup, it's very bronze naturally. Just it's so cute. I love it. I would have never thought to tie this up and I can just accessorize and be good to go for happy hour. <laughs> exactly. And this is practically your work uniform. Yeah. You know, we just added accessories and um, made it a little sexier because you have, you know, you have a great physique. Don't be afraid to show it. I could never work at your job, but it's all good. Yeah. You're definitely ready for happy hour. Yes. I, I mean, I would have never thought to just tie this up, put some shoes, accessories, and good to go. <laughs> okay, awesome. So the second look that we're going to give her is something that she could wear on her first date on the beach, like what she said and possibly a little bit of nightlife after that. So for the second look, in keeping in line with the 70s theme, we wanted to change Carla's hair into the perfect beehive. So to accomplish that, Tanika removed the braids and teased the top portion of the hair for the look. And as a finishing touch, we added a hair accessory, which was very popular in the 70s. As you can see, Tanika achieved the perfect beehive. You have the, the rounded hump, the hair accessories, and the waves coming down. And now for the makeup. To take the makeup from day to night, Frankia just did a few things like darken the eyeliner. Instead of using a pencil eyeliner, she moved to liquid eyeliner, so it's bolder. We deepened the blush and added color to her lips. Before she just had lip gloss, and now we added like a coral color. We wanted to keep the colors um, earth tones, coral complements her um, complexion, and now she just has a natural glow. We wanted to also um, just highlight her natural beauty, so nothing too dark, but this is how we take the day to night look. So as I've mentioned before, we wanted to um, keep to a 70s theme and rompers are really huge. 
for the 70s. So I chose this romper and the green in particular is something that Carla would never wear before, but it's such a bright color green that although it's earth tones, it gives her her skin like a pop of color. And we hadn't tried anything on prior to the show. She did one fitting. The cutouts in the back was perfect. I also liked the deep v-neck because it complemented her chest. So a romper like this would be perfect for a first date because it's not showing too much, it's not a mini dress, but at the same time it complements her curves perfectly and it actually looks like it was made for her. Hi guys, it's Samoya Robinson on CLL TV. Right now I'm here with Miss Elizabeth Vaughn. How are you tonight? I'm good. That's good. Okay, she has her own boutique. How awesome is that? Miss Elizabeth, could you please tell us about your boutique? Like the name of it, where is it located? Yes. Okay, so the name is L'Amour Boutique. We're on Bird Road and 67. Um, we've been open for half a year. Okay. And yeah, we're there. What kind of styles do you have in your boutique? Well, we have all kinds of styles. It's more teen, junior type of thing. And um, yeah, that's it. And what inspired you to have your music? Is it just something that you randomly decided that you wanted to do or you always wanted to be an entrepreneur? I'm really young. I started at 19 and I would like to inspire kids to have their own thing. You know, not to be in drugs and with bad things Followers. and in the streets. So, you know, just kind of do their own thing and start their own business. Well, I'm very, very, very supportive of that. Is there any other way they, they could contact you if they want to stop by your boutique? Yeah, um, we have Instagram. Um, it's Lamour Boutique INC. And also you can call us. It's 305-781-1906. Okay, thank you so much. And just so you know, her style is in this show. And it's amazing. Again, it's Samoya Robinson and Elizabeth. Bye. <laughs> Hey Leah. Hey girl. <laughs> We're Harrison with the CEO of Steel and Mac. How are you, Miss Caramoda? I'm good. <laughs> we made an awesome show, didn't we? Yeah. yeah. Miss Cara, how did you enjoy this season? Um, it was really what I wanted it to be, you know. And the name Stylist Diaries come from Stilo Magazine Style Diary. Um, and just from the passion that I want to feature and really um, push a lot of talent that's here in South Florida. As you know, Miami um, have been named as Tackyville by nameless people mm -hmm. in other parts of the fashion industry in the world. But we are so not tacky and we are so fashionable and it's just that we need to highlight that more. So. Really just Stilo is coming out there in Miami and um, Broward and we're really setting the tone and having great events where people who love fashion, not even if you just work in fashion, but you love fashion can just connect and really share your businesses and your ideas and just experience what we have, what our vision is. And really just taking what we see that you want and what you your talent and really just showcasing it to the world. But I really enjoy the show and everything put together. You did an amazing job. You did an amazing job telling Ryan what to do behind those cameras. <laughs> I wanted to say that um, I love Carol's brand. Uh, we've been, you know, acquainted for years now, and she's always done PR for really good events. And the, the brand Stilo itself, it's so, um, there's so much to it, you know? And I feel like you, you, you can offer so much. So this is like a great platform for us to, to highlight, you know, like what you said, local brands and do provide so many, so many services for them. We got <laughs> South Florida and there's a lot of fashion, a lot of talent. So just stay tuned and come out to the event. Follow us. Um, there's three now. We have um, on Twitter at Stilo Fashion Mix. We have at Stilo TV USA. We have StiloMag.com. 
um, and that goes for Instagram as well. And we also have where's um, Stilo Mag on Facebook. So follow us, sign up to our mailing list. That's it. <laughs> But I'm so glad that we were able to do this tonight where I'm so glad we can connect with everyone, um, makeup artists, designers, stylists, boutique owners, everyone, because it's not only about yourself. You have to reach out and help out everyone else because we all need help and we all need the support. And when we do have that support, we can generally give it back to other people. And that's what it's all about. I'm Samoya Robinson. I'm Leah Ello. Carol Moda. And you're watching Stylist Diary on Zillow TV. Good night.